Tony D and Little Joan with a screenwriter's rant on the Silent Twins, uh, starring Letitia Wright from Black Panther 2. Smash like and subscribe. Little sub trailer there. Thank you for smash liking and subscribing. Thanks for buying my books. Uh, sold some books today. This is um, this is a movie based on a true story about a pair of twins who I guess they didn't like talking to people, so they only talked to each other. And then they ended up getting institutionalized. Um, and then it's about their struggle to be reunited again. So, you know, it's about <clears throat> the system screwing over two gentle souls. And that's pretty much it, it seems. I mean, I'm not familiar with the, uh, uh, with, uh, the actual characters or the actual people. But apparently, part of it had to do with them living in their imaginations. I don't know if they actually wrote books that got published. I'm going to guess that they did. Maybe this is the happy ending. Letitia Wright and Tamara Lawrence. And, uh, you know, it's a family drama. And then it's partly that and their fantasy of marrying different guys and having adventures. And it's in September... Ah, in theater September 16th. Not yet rated. Ah, it looks okay. I mean, it looks... It looks like a... A fantasy drama. Of sorts. Imagination set them free. Um, you know, it... A lot of these stories frustrate me. Because I feel frustrated. Like the characters are frustrated, you know. And uh, so it's hard for me to watch these movies. I don't like characters that get frustrated like this. Not any slam against the quality of the movie. It's just, it's not, I don't like movies like that. I mean, I like the endings when, <laughs> when they finally overcome their adversity. But I don't know. I feel bad for the real people. Um, but uh, it looks well done. I mean, Letitia Wright is... Uh, Pretty good actress. She's all right. This is uh, a chance for her to do some uh, critically acclaimed movie. This is the kind of thing that's critically acclaimed. Ooh, what happened there? It's like, uh, is he lying in a pool of, of what? A water? Is that water? I don't know what that is. See, part of this could be all in their imaginations. So, you got a lot of stuff going on here. I... On the one hand, let's see if there's any more info here. The Silent Twins is the astounding story of twin sisters who only communicated with one another. As a result, they created rich, fascinating world to escape the reality of their own lives. Ba uh, lives. Based on the best-selling book, The Silent Twins, stars Letitia Wright and Tamara, Tamara Lawrence. I, get, I mean, as a writer, I can kind of relate to them a little bit, which I guess is why I wouldn't want to go see it, because I'd be like, oh, man... <laughs> <laughs> um, but that being said, I think it I think it looks good. The first act is probably the twins are born and they seem normal and then as they grow up they withdraw and they only talk to each other. And then the parents try to get them help. Second act, um, they've got more and more extreme. Um, you know, at first it's kind of a novelty, it doesn't matter, they're little kids. But as they get older, the parents worry, and uh, some of the doctors talk them into more stringent measures. And then it looks like something happens. I'm not sure if it's in real life or not. Um, maybe they run away or run amok in some way, as teenagers do. And then I think they're sentenced to be institutionalized for some reason. Maybe the parents died. I don't know. But then they are separated, which I'm sure is a huge hardship for them. And then it's about their eventual, you know, reuniting. Thanks to wonderful woke people who understood them. I don't know. I don't know if it's woke. I shouldn't say it is. I mean, who knows? They seem to be having a normal life there. But is that fantasy or is that reality? It's hard to tell in a trailer. See, that's probably fantasy right there. But who knows? Who knows? The Silent Twins. I mean, it, yeah, it doesn't look bad. I, It's not my kind of movie. Sorry. But it looks well done. 
looks well directed. Um, looks like you know they're following the path. I mean, here they are being reunited. I guess. Hmm. I don't know. Uh, anyhow, that's a, that's about all I got to say. It's kind of hard to tell from this trailer, you know. Other than it's based on a true story and what their situation is, the plot of the actual movie, other than they're institutionalized, which I guess is the whole thing. I mean, it's not much here. Like, I would have liked to have known a little bit more about the characters around them a little bit. And, you know, what what's the parents' role in this? Like, are they all gung-ho to get them normalized? Or are they more like being pushed into it by the powers that be? Or what what's the story there? Um... So, comes out September 16th. Feels like an Oscar thing. Yeah. Feels like a thing that would be uh, Oscar worthy. Because uh, it tends to be actors and actresses. When they, when they play somebody with a disability, then uh, uh, that tends to be Oscar bait, right? Um, which is interesting because Hollywood has been screaming at us about Oh, you have to be that thing to play that thing in a movie, right? Yeah. Anyhow, that's it for me, Tony D, and Little Joan. Check us out on Odyssey, BitChute, and Rumble for our more base takes. We got a Hollywood hot take and a news blast. We'll see you in the next one.